Definitely. I don't like all the mudslinging. Nobody has really said anything, you know. And I think it's degenerated recently into rather mundane mudslinging. I think they're boring. I fell asleep last night. In the various election camps, they watched the debates closely. The Carter people pleased when their man won a point. And over at Ford headquarters, there was relief that there were no gaffes and excitement whenever their man seemed to get the better of his opponent. But outside the campaign offices, it's been a very different story. There's been little enthusiasm for the debates. Often there's been anger about them and about the level of this campaign in general. I decided how I want to vote already. I don't like the debates. Uh, uh, I think they're boring. I fell asleep last night uh, in the middle of one of them. Well, I haven't been able to make up my mind yet because nobody has really said anything, you know. They're on the defensive and they're being very cautious, especially last night. Uh, trying not to make a mistake, I guess. They've been helpful to me, yes, yes. It's good to see the two, compare the two men side by side, and see their personalities and their stands on the different issues. I've gotten quite a bit out of it. I don't like all the mudslinging. I said if, if Jimmy Carter feels that way about President Ford and President Ford feels that way about Jimmy Carter, if it's true, then neither of them should be president. Uh, I think it's a pretty boring campaign. I don't think either of the two candidates are very exciting. You know, I think that... Uh, the campaign itself has been rather boring, and I think it's degenerated recently into rather mundane mudslinging. That's a pretty fair reflection of how most Americans are feeling about this election. All the polls report that most Americans are turned off by this year's two candidates. Or as one newspaper columnist in this town put it, this is the election between President Flub and Governor Fluff. Michael Brunson, ITN, Washington.